11 for 23 in the game now. But it's been a while since they've hit one. Perkins trying to initiate on Carrington. Perkins falls away. High archer, no good, and a foul. You know, and Carrington hit. The unsung hero has been the job Dix has done on Christie here in the last four or five minutes. Blocking foul will go against Sanford. To Dix. Short. Freeman comes away with it. Freeman blocked by Payne. How about the gutsy play by Payne? With four fouls, that's a huge play. Chance to tie for Minnesota. Hawkins up top. Payne. Oh, didn't need the dribble. 45 in the second half. One out of two for Payne. Gonna go down to the wire here in Iowa City. And if you're Iowa, you're, you're an outstanding foul shooter, right? Team at 78%. Just continue to attack. Sanford, three. Rammed in and out, Freeman battling again. McCaffrey's got it, pulls it out, ripped away by Hawkins and a foul. That's on Hawkins. Good job by Freeman of just kind of keeping it alive. And Looked like a foul on the first yeah, swipe, the first maybe one. not the second one. Hawkins picks up his fourth. I would agree, Jeff. I thought on the first one. Patrick McCaffrey with 20 in this game. He joins Sanford with 20 plus. 21 for Patrick. Boy, Carrington's now limping. He kind of landed awkwardly. See him down there? It was, he went to take the ball out of bounds. I don't know if he stepped on a slick spot or whatever, but... Well, that'll allow Iowa to get into a little bit of pressure. Kind of phony pressure, but pressure nonetheless. Four-point lead for the Hawkeyes under a minute. Christie blocked by Freeman. And talk about closing out. How about right here? Good job by Dix of rotating over and then because he didn't catch it cleanly and then five to shoot. Perkins bleeding that clock down. He's got to get going. Hawkins oh, why? and a foul. Why? I mean, if you're if you're Hawkins fouls out. Perkins at the line shooting three, where he's an 81% free throw shooter. I mean, the way that Iowa played in the first half, to say that they could potentially have 90 points in this game would have been really a stretch. You have to make sure that the disappointment of the second 20 minutes doesn't carry over to the next 40. Minnesota. Doesn't get easier for them. They've got to go to West Lafayette and take on Purdue next. No easy task. Oh. Mitchell drives. May have been the last ditch effort. Christie for three off the heel. Freeman another rebound. Enan fouls him. 7.4 to go. And Iowa feeling it in Iowa City. What a comeback. Yes. That may have saved the Hawkeyes' season. Yeah, but they were in trouble, to say the least. And they just kept chipping away. I like the response of Iowa defensively. You know, they, they were giving up wide open shots, regardless of zone defense or man-to-man, -man, and they made the adjustments. Foul trouble also hindered Minnesota greatly, but it was the defensive intensity especially of Josh Dix I want to continue to give accolades to that young man he's showing you you don't have to score to impact the ball game oh Mitchell hits a three late but that's gonna do it for this one Iowa wins it 90 85 it is the second largest come from behind victory